John, speaking of, you know, people being disrespectful, I, I'd be remiss if I did not bring up the ridiculous asshole that uh, slapped you twice in the face from the WWF. I mean, these are the types of things that are just so disrespectful. This is this is what? This is an interview? This was an would... interview. John Sossel used to do a lot of man on the street yeah. type of interviews. I was doing consumer reporting, going yes. and confronting businesses and saying, why are you a crook? And I was always scared I'd be shot or beaten up or something. And nobody Damn. ever did anything because it's having the camera is kind of like having mom watching. Mm -hmm. But finally, I, I was a high school wrestler. So the advantage is that I look young now. But when I was in high school, my voice was up here. And I had <laughs> short. That sucked. Um, Were you one of those guys but, in high school that was like 14 yet still had a mustache? Or no, you grew, that, you grew into that later? I didn't grow into that till I was... In my 40s or something. Damn, I was immature, but I could okay. wrestle at 95 pounds. I was <laughs> and so, so I what? learned wrestling. So I was okay. annoyed at pro wrestling that a lot of people thought it was real. I mm. thought we should show that it isn't, that we got a wrestler to, to go in the ring and, and throw me and show how they fake things and talk about him. He would use a razor blade to cut his forehead to bleed. And I wanted to set it up like we usually do with the business and say, what do you say to the people who say it's fake? And they, let, Vince McMahon let me go backstage at Madison Square Garden and mm -hmm. I interviewed uh, an Iranian wrestler. They were they, if, the, Iron you, Sheik? the Iron Sheik? The Iron Sheik. Damn, the Iron Sheik. <laughs> Shout out to the Iron Sheik and the Junkyard Dog and Sergeant Slaughter, Hulk Hogan, oh, so you didn't Macho watch Man wrestling Randy back Savage, in the, the Ultimate all. Warrior. No, I don't I never watched it, but go ahead. And I forget what they said, but yes. this one jerk, Dave Schultz, 6'8", 280 pounds. Holy wow. moly. Was very, Blonde hair. Very, he was basically the fake Hulk Hogan. A little bit like that, but yeah. he was a real athlete. And I think he may have taken speed to get psyched for his performance. Mm -hmm. He was really wired. And I said, well, what do you say about it being fake? You think this is fake? Whack, he knocks me down. One time on the right, and then one time and on the I left. And I stupidly got up again, and he hit me in the other ear. What the hell were you thinking when that happened? I was thinking, holy shit, <laughs> but I hope the camera caught this. <laughs> you said, True holy journalist. shit, but I hope the camera True caught True journalist this. right there. I hope the camera I, got is it. Is it on your channel or no? Do you have the video or no on your channel? It's not on my channel, but sadly, YouTube, it's one of my most watched yeah. Videos. Well, if yeah. you type in John Stossel, that comes up. I don't know if you know that. Well, maybe on you know Google has learned to know you, oh, and they are you think if out you big type tech right now, you you want to see people getting beaten up. It may not come up on somebody else's feed. Huh. So it means oh, you saying... <laughs> like watching him getting beat no, up. That's I, what I, he's saying I, to I, you. <laughs> I, I would give John Stossel a hug. So if you enjoyed this little short segment from the podcast that we did, here's another short segment to watch. Or if you want to see the entire podcast, click over here. Take care, everybody. Bye bye.